Cranky Gun Reviews here with a short little video regarding my Charter Arms Undercover 38 Special. This is an old model from the 1960s. You can tell because it has the ejection rod free floating underneath the barrel. It has a very nice blued luster. This one had a little bit of damage from the original owner, some holster wear. I've replaced the cylinder on this one because the original cylinder was all covered in rust and there's a little bit of oxidation on the frame. But this is one of my favorite little shooters. If you guys didn't know from my previous videos, snub nose revolvers are probably some of my favorite guns overall. Here I was just taking it out to the range because it had been a long time since I shot it, and I forgot how snappy this was, even with only a 130 grain factory full metal jacket. Now this is my third Charter Arms Revolver. Before I had this one, I also had the Target Pathfinder in 22, which you've seen in a lot of my videos. I also had a Bulldog Pug in 44 Special. And 44 Special in a gun this size with a lightweight frame was a lot less comfortable to shoot than I prefer. And even though, like I've said before, I'm not a wimp, I can handle the recoil. It just, for something that you're gonna carry, or something you want to take out to the range and plink with. It's not a round that you like to shoot a lot. I would pit this up against any Smith & Wesson in the same era. This thing has very good timing. It has tight lockup, and I've never had a single issue with it. It's a very sweet shooter, and I highly recommend, if you can find an older Charter Arms revolver from the 1960s or 70s, they tend to be a little bit better quality than the newer ones. A lot of the newer ones, uh, they're either coated in paint or some type of coating or their stainless steel and I don't particularly like the Charter Arms stainless steel. But that's just a short little video on the Charter Arms Undercover 38 Special Snub Nose Revolver. Thanks for watching another short edition of Cranky Gun Reviews. Have a great weekend. God bless America and keep shooting. Thanks for watching.